my Daily Dollar Tree and they have the Perry's, I believe it's Perry's door collars, right? But guess what, guys? They have Elvis. Now, this is for a very big dog. They have this one. I don't know what it says. I didn't see that one. Didn't see this one at Winterville. So be on the lookout. They have an Elvis one in small. Um, that's the one I would need for Benji. They even have a unicorn one. I'll pick that up. That's really cute. Yeah, Winterville didn't have those. Let me look for one for Parker. Parker's black. I don't want to get him a black collar, but I cannot get him the unicorn one. Um, all right, I do have a blue one uh, from Perry's in his size. But be on the lookout for those guys. Those are super cute. This is the trash dish detergent. I believe it's the one. Oh, I don't know. That's LA's totally awesome. I don't know. It was another brand I showed you guys. But look at this one. Look how watery it looks. One of you said it was good. I don't trust it. So um, I'll leave that behind. I just seen the 39 gallon from Handy Wrap at Dollar General. Handy Wrap is sold at Dollar General down the one dollar aisle guys so keep that in mind they have a 39 gallon for um for count bag from wizard check there guys if you have a dollar general near you check there first i usually see these at dollar general these are from glad this is so cute game night candy land paper snack bowls but i haven't seen these at dollar general that's really cute it is cute I don't know if this is a a new cup or just repackaging because there are a lot of repackaging there's a lot of repackaging going on but this is everyday cups party cups 16 count they feel different they feel much more sturdier but then here's everyday foam tray so i think that they're just repackaging their items guys i think that's what it is haven't seen those before not my style but this is not bad this is giving me full vibes this one says choose happy it's a decorative pillow in the Dollar Tree Plus section definitely giving me full vibes it's the only one like it the face serums made it locally I found these in Kingston however it's from that brand that gave that foot scrub and that uh, foot cream that burned me so these are in my get back bag not even gonna risk burning my face let me know guys if you tried that foot cream and scrub what do you think or if you've tried these serums first local loca location where they have the plus bread or brand name breads for three dollars so they have the thomas english muffins and plate plain or cinnamon raisin they have the ballpark burger buns not seeing hot dog sara lee honey wheat sara lee butter bread and classic white i have seen this on the road on vacation in florida but now it's local be on the lookout if you interested i bread is expensive everything has went up but i just think sometimes in the supermarket you can get a pretty decent deal or a sale two for three two for five so be on the lookout we hold the tough plus spray cleaner that packaging looks different i don't remember the new in advance i have to look at mine and then this location still has the wipes have not tried it yet and those glass wipes they are great but you can get them from dollar general down the one dollar aisle the second runner up in town she always does great displays she even went the extra mile and put some sunflowers here so if you're into this theme i'm seeing it in most stores on the opposite side she has the blue set i'm still on the fence about those glasses and she paired it with uh, the matte silver chargers, which I think that would look pretty with. I'm not a fan of the kitchen textiles, but um, it's a beautiful set otherwise to me. Starting to see more and more full floral. They had those last year. They have the leaf garlands. They even brought these back, which I thought was so pretty. Oh, these could have been left over from last year, guys. Winterville actually 
did do their best to pack away all of the fall stuff. And these, these were my favorite. So you're making wreaths. Be on the lookout. And they have these maple leaves, the uh, picks with the pumpkins. So they're getting ready, guys. Ready or not, it'll be here before you know it. These calendars, guys, are still here. And from the commentary on Instagram, people are not happy with the $1.50 price. I think they're slowly rolling it out. It started with the sunglasses. You know, we've seen an increase in the soda. I think eventually, but that's probably from the vendor, they're saying. But I think there'll be, you know, helium balloons that are, what, $2 now or $1.50? I'm not sure. I think $1.50. So I think they are not going to roll it out like the 25 cents like all at once i think it's gonna slowly you know i'm sure they got these on deck waiting waiting to change everything over i don't know if these are new guys they've had so many different storage bins but they have them in those coordinating colors of the teal the blue and clear in place of the white so it looks like they didn't pack them out yet always check by your register because you never know what you're going to see okay guys the truck came a day early but they're still unpacking so i won't see everything new but we got the sure fresh cereal containers but it's not that big jumbo one everybody was finding and i'm very happy here it is and i like this size better because it's just me and i spy and we don't eat cereal like that so i'm happy with this size and you can use it for other things this is the display it comes in also new this week is this pop-up hamper from Laundry Essentials, $1.25. It only comes in white. It's 13 inches wide, 13 inches deep, 21 inches high. $1.25, especially kids are going to be going to college. This might be nice for a dorm room, um, baby clothes. You could put this maybe in a baby shower basket. Be on the lookout, guys, for this as well. Guys, I'm in that location that I told you is very, very late at putting things out. It's like an almost brand new untouched Ioni Cali makeup beauty bar that had my favorite liquid blushes. And um, these fat chubby sticks are so nice. I already hauled the pink rose. And now I'm seeing this flamingo red. And what it is is a lip liner and lipstick. You will have to resharpen it. But these are so good. So I'm happy to see this makeup bar. They're just very, very, as you can see behind, because this dropped months ago. I'm only getting one. I'm leaving some for somebody else because I do have a supply. But I love this liquid blush. It's like they're trying to get this store together because, like I said, they are months and months behind with certain hot items. And the shelves look very stocked. As you can see, look, they have a lot of that um, Maybelline Go Green tinted foundation. They just put that out. It wasn't here before. I don't know. I'm happy, though, because this was my first Dollar Tree that I came to when I moved to Greenville, and I was excited. And then it just went downhill. We know this dropped a while ago, but they're just getting it out. The Candid Foundation along with this these two have been my everyday foundations i kind of alternate so i'm happy to see more if you live local they do have different shades hey oh my god i don't know why i'm excited don't ask me why it's just a damn mitt but the mini mitts i'm finally seeing some like christmas colors so look at this plaid i really like it and look at this one with the peanuts, a Charlie Brown Christmas. I have not seen anybody show this one. They could have. It has a little stain here. I'm going to use my little stain eraser. I'm not leaving it behind. I wonder will they take some money off. I doubt it. Not this store. But look at this cutie. I'm going to bring it. I'm going to get it though. But look at this, guys. There are other prints, but you can pair these together as well, along with the solid red or green have this striped red and white one they have this striped blue one that's almost like a denim blue um, this burnt orange one would be perfect for fall we've seen solid red before so be on the lookout guys if you're interested
like these zip ties guys I have never seen I've seen red and black but I've never seen red and gray I'm a Ziploc fanatic they even have some small clear ones in there get in my cart these are great for crafting especially wreath making guys if you don't want something to be permanent zip locks of the bomb.com I was late to the Ziploc party but I'm on it now location did get some of the thousand count puzzles I'm only seeing the zodiac one they could have had the others and sold out but this is the only one that I'm seeing Being that they're so far behind I wanted to find the old Raymond socks but they have Teddy Grahams they have the Kool-Aid Sunny D uh, Ego which I think I seen on the road Skippy Chips Ahoy the Little Feet Man you know, after I made fun of them being too small, I never found them. I don't know where they are, y'all. I was going to put them in a giveaway. I can't find those Elvis socks. I guess he got up and left my house. Calling him little. Yeah, I was hoping to find the old, if you know what I'm talking about. We got um, a pink style Raymond sock last week. But like I said, I just was hoping because they're so behind here. I might find it on the road. Okay guys, I found more of the $1.25 motivational water bottles. Unfortunately, some people were saying that it scanned $1.25 on the app, but when they got to the register, the staff told them, no, it's five. That's not right. These are $1.25, and here are all the colors. So they have a mauve pink and blue. They have a purple and a teal and a blue and orange. Don't walk past these like I did, guys, because I seen these last week and I assumed that they were $5. Really cute heart keychains, guys, near the register. Really cute colors. Be on the lookout. As always, guys, I hope you enjoyed this shop with me. The haul will be uploaded in a separate video. I hope you guys have a great 4th of July with family and friends. And I will see you in the next video. Take care. Have an amazing Wednesday. Bye-bye.